And we are live. And the camera has messed up again. It doesn't oh, like Formula One. Yeah. Jess, thank you for the like and the share on the stream. We're going to try and fix this. It doesn't like me tonight. Formula One does not like mouse gaming. It is official. But it's not going to have much of a choice. Because we are going to go ahead with it anyway. Dad coming in. How you doing, Dad? Hope you are very well. How you doing, Jess? Thank you for coming in. Thank you for the like and the share. Dad, don't forget to hit that like button. You've been doing it long enough. And unfortunately, we can't bring you the wheel cam. Which is an absolute pain because I was enjoying it on the NASCAR. It just doesn't like Formula One. Formula One doesn't like Streamlabs OBS. Every time we get the cameras set right, we click into the game and boop, they all go all over the place. So we have no webcam. We have no wheel cam. But we do have Formula One. Thank you for the like on the stream there, Dad. I hope you're having a great day. It got very warm today over here. It was up in the 20s. Wayne Leach coming in. How you doing, buddy? Hope you are very, very well. Thank you for coming in. So we are trying our hand at Formula One. I don't oh, think this is going to be yeah. something that we stick with because it doesn't like Streamlabs OBS. Streamlabs OBS is what we use to run Europe mats. So, hello Matt, hello Tia, Tyler, and Logan, and Tara, and Matt, and Dad. So, thank you all for coming in. I hope you're all having a great day. I'm definitely jumping in the chair after today. I had a little bit of a nap when I came in. Well, I'll try to. I kept getting woken up by Randa. Every time I dozed off, it was pew, wake up. But it is what it is. Will Blue in the house. How you doing, Will? Hope you are very well. I'm glad to see that your car is finally on the way forward, buddy. I know, I saw the pictures and I'm so happy for you, Will. So if that was absolutely awesome. Smoggy88 coming in with the like. How you doing, Smoggy? Hope you are very, very well. And thank you for the like as well there, Will. Smoggy, thank you for the double. Guys, if you don't know already, please head over to the Smoggy88 gaming page. Check out Smoggy. Drop him a like. Drop him a follow. Check out his content. And share the love as always. Yeah, this is one game I didn't think I was going to have problems with, with it being fairly up to date, but this one's caused us more issues than anything. So I don't think we'll be sticking with this one for much, even though I do love Formula One. So that just makes it more preemptive to bring Formula One 2021 to the scene. Put the last little bit together this morning, and the only thing I have to do is the put the inner fender liner on, but I can do that later. Awesome. And I bet you feel so much better now it's all done. The stress has just gone straight down. You're back to happy will. Which is great. So guys, head over to the Smoggy88 gaming page. Check out his content. Drop him a like. Drop him a follow. I've got cables and leads and everything all over the place tonight. I don't know why. Everything's just going mad. Phil Jones in the house. How you doing, Phil? Oh. Phil is a very, yeah, very. Phil is a very, very good friend from Lifestyle Gaming, and I still didn't put his picture up on my stream deck. Chrissy didn't remind me, but then Chrissy has been busy herself today doing her Dead by Daylight stream, and she did an absolutely awesome job. Mass and F1, a match made in heaven. Mm, Formula One 2020, I nearly got thrown out the window. Jonathan Carter and Paintbrush 200 coming in as well. Let's get these under wraps. Lifestyle Vapes, head over to Facebook. Head over to the Lifestyle Vapes page if you need uh, any vape requirements. Also, head over to the Lifestyle Gaming page. Check out Phil. Drop him a like and drop him a follow. He is due to stream soon. So share the love over there as well. Mr. Jonathan Carter in the house. Mr. Paintbrush, guys, if you haven't already, 
please head over to the Paintbrush 200 page. There is a competition on his page to have your artwork featured as his logo. So head over to the Paintbrush 200 page, drop a like, drop a follow, and get your entry in, and you may see your logo right there. And on Jonathan's page, of course. Ellis Ma in the house. How are you doing, sweetheart? Thank you for coming over. Hope you're very, very well. So, with your project now finished, I guess I'll be your new crew chief. Indeed, Will. Indeed. Don't need to argue. If you can put an engine in a car, you can bat fix my Formula One car. You're good. Thanks. Just chilling tonight. Awesome. So, put your feet up. We're going to try some Formula One. If it bugs out, we'll switch. We'll, we'll end the stream, come back, and we'll put NASCAR on. This game has caused me so much, so many issues, which is just making me want to see Formula One 2021. But that's not due out till July the 16th. Damon Wanchana, Big Ranch Gaming in the house. How are you doing, Big Ranch? Hope you and the family are all very well. You're a rubbish designer, no pop. Get out of it, Smoggy. But guys, if you haven't already, please head over to the Big Wanch Gaming page. Drop a like, drop a follow, check out his awesome content. He is absolutely awesome. How you doing, Big Wanch? Hope you are doing very, very well, my friend. Hope you are healing very, very rapidly. We miss you on our screens. We hope you are recovering very, very well. I'm starting to sweat already because I'm wearing my uh, mouse gaming hoodie, which you can't see, just about. Courtesy of Customized Inks, Mr. J. Harfield. And he also did that. The mouse gaming mug. And I have a backup. I have my mouse gaming travel mug too. All courtesy of Customized Inks on Facebook. Message J. Hartfield if you need any doesn't have to be my merch it doesn't have to be Chris's merch from Miss Chrissy 85 it can be anything you like so head over to customized links on Facebook drop them the code mouse 10 from this page Miss Chrissy has her own code and she is only allowed to say it on her page so either head head over to J Hartfield customized links drop the code mouse 10 he'll give you 10% off your order so with that said we are going to get some racing done. Let's head down. Um, I'm not even sure where we're going to start. We'll, we'll do a Formula 1 2020 race. There we go. There are the links for the customised inks. Uh, well, let, let's go. I don't even know where to go with cars. Let's ride one of the legendary Ferraris. I don't even know who he is. So we'll go with Sebastian Vettel. Uh, does anybody have any suggestions which track we should do? The first person that throws up a track, I'm going to pick that track. So that's the first one on my screen. I will give it a try. We're we'll coming straight in with Monaco, so let's go and find Monaco, shall we? There we go, Monaco. Uh, practice type? No, we want to do. We want to do no practice type. We want to do one shot practice. Formation lap. We'll do five laps. Let's go. So we've got one shot qualifying, and then we've got five lap race. We'll see how it goes. Bear in mind, I'm using the steering wheel. It is set to 270 degrees, with it being the G29. The force feedback has been turned down to 25% because when I hit a bump earlier, the steering wheel went absolutely crazy, and it, it nearly caused me a bad wrist injury. But hopefully, I'm coming across clear. Hopefully, you can hear the game sounds. 
Uh, let's just go to the track. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you can hear that clearly. Wow, ow, 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 straight away. Bear in mind, this is the first proper time we have streamed this, so it may not be brilliant. All good on the sounds, awesome, that's what we'd like to hear. I haven't played this game for quite a while. Me and Jeff have this on pre-order for 2021, which is released on July 16th. If you want to go and pre-order your copy, go over to Steam. They have it there. If you know where else to get uh, game codes, it is on those sites as well, aka CD Keys and G2A. But this, uh, we have this pre-ordered for t July 16th. I believe this, this is one shot qualifying and I'm doing absolutely terrible. At least the car is responding and doing what I want it to do. Qualifying complete, I don't even know where I qualified so that tells me something. Brilliant, we qualified in 20th. That's practically last on the... Uh, on the grid. We're all ready for tomorrow's race, but before we begin, let's have a quick look at those who will be fronting the grid. Verstappen, Hamilton and Valtteri Bottas. Yeah, we're, da we're down there, 20th. We'll be back tomorrow as we head into the Grand Prix. Great, it's going to be a fun one. I may need to set the wheel up a little bit tougher. So, the graphics look absolutely amazing though. Mr. Hicks in the house, how you doing sir? Hope you are very, very well. We have just done one shot qualifying in Formula 1. We're on the Monte, Monte Carlo track and we have come 20th. Yeah, yeah, get on with it. How are you doing, buddy? Hope you're having a great day. Hope you are very safe. We're about to start this race. I'm sweating already. I can't turn that fan on because it makes too much noise and it sets the audio off. It buzzes. Feedback. I am very well. I am waiting for Jeff to go live. As are we all. And... As you've probably seen on the Mouse Gaming page, my personal Facebook page, we have hyped him up to the eyeballs. Adrian Winchester coming in with the light there. Hope you're doing very well, buddy. Hope you are very, very well. Thank you for coming in and dropping the light there, buddy. Yeah, we have hyped Jeff up. Jeff is streaming at 5, I believe, 5 CST. I'm not sure how far away that is. But hopefully, the count the countdown is on, and we can't wait. We will all be there cheering Jeff on. Three hours time, so that will be 11 p.m. GMT. Great. So we can't wait. We'll be there. We will be there cheering Jeff on, showing our support as we always do. So if you haven't already, guys, please head over to eager gaming drop him a like drop him a follow he is going live in approximately three hours so that will be fun mr kenny g kenny gaston has noticed me noticing him noticing me how you doing kenny hope you are very well much much love my brother hope you are very very safe we are going to break his notifications. He's going to be overwhelmed with us all going over there. Matt Bryce in the house. How you doing, Matty? Hope you are very, very well. Hope you are safe. Long time no speak, my friend. 
we have been very busy and I hope you and the family are all safe and well too. Chrissy, thank you for dropping the uh, link there. Guys, please head over to Eager Gaming. Jeff will be streaming live in approximately three hours. Guys, also head over to the amazing Kenny G, Kenny's mind page. Drop him a like, drop him a follow. As always, he is a legend. And Kenny coming in with the 100 stars. Thank you so much, Kenny. Really, really do appreciate that, buddy. And I'm going to give you a... You are oh, awesome. Yeah, guys, go, go over to the Eager Gaming page. And as Mr. Hicks said there, go support our favourite Aussie. The, the, the legendary Australian moderator debuting tonight as a streamer. And we can't wait. Oh, Kenny, you're not going to start with the squeezes already? Phil, thank you so much, buddy. 11 p.m. GMT, approximately. And are we going to get into this thing again where it's the squeezes? I'll do one. Do it. There you go. That's the first bar of the uh, tune. Can't believe that absolutely blew up last night. That was insane. You guys were absolutely crazy. I haven't seen Daniel Hartfield yet. Normally he's sat in here, but he could be somewhere. Corey, Corey Rhodes coming in with the light there. How you doing, buddy? Thank you for coming in. You want to squeeze? Uh oh. We're getting into this again. Kenny's gonna blow my mind. Want to squeeze it? Uh, my camera won't go down low enough. There you go. There's your squeeze. There's your little move twerk, shall we say? Kenny, you're a legend. Scaring people off. We've only got eight people in the room. We need some more people in the room. So let your let your friends, family know this is a PG stream. It will always be a PG stream. Not more, Kenny. Kenny's hitting the star train already. Da da da. There you go. There's your squeezes. We never get any racing done at this rate. Kenny, you're a legend. Thank you. Much love, my brother. I noticed you noticing me. Noticing you. I've done it the wrong way. I've noticed you noticing me noticing you. <laughs> Absolute pleasure, bro. It made everybody laugh last night. It made everybody giggle. It made me laugh as well. And when I, I had somebody message me last night, they have not laughed that much. And they nearly fell off the sofa laughing. So if that is the way that we make people happy, then that's the way... I'm happy with so let's get this race started we've started we're starting at the back of the grid so let's make our move and we are off my wheel isn't very sensitive at all I like a little bit of a kickback on the steering wheel don't know why it hasn't done that uh, we want to go into the Logitech edit. We want the force feedback and vibration up a little bit more than 20%. Let's stick it on 40. Save to control scheme. And just before we get underway, 
Mr. Chris Edwards comes in with the triple. Chris from Phoenix Infinity Gaming, and I've just locked everything flying. Guys, if you haven't already, please head over to the Phoenix Infinity Gaming page. Drop Chris a like, and drop Chris a follow. Tune in, watch his content, and have a great time. There is the link in the chat. Kenny, because you are a legend and you sent me some amazing stars, one time only. Peter Harrison becoming a brand new follower. Peter, welcome into the Mayas Gaming family. Hope you're doing well, buddy. Long time no speak. So, Kenny, you're going to have to wait a second. I've got to welcome in the new followers. Peter, this is for you. Welcome to the Mayas Gaming family. Hope you are very well. Thank you for becoming a brand new follower. Kenny, just for you, one time only. I don't normally play your soundboard. But because you are so nicely and you dropped those amazing stars, just for you. Oh yeah? There you go. So let's get back onto the live streams and the sources. I talked to my best friend and he said two out of three the selective project can work when it is a kind of off tune. Oh, that's Chrissy and Kenny having a chat there. How are you doing, Chris? Hope you are very well. You've joined us just at the start, just off the line of the Monte Carlo Formula One. I'm still tweaking the settings on the steering wheel. And I want it to be good, but I don't want it to come across with the force feedback on the steering wheel as too loud because when this hits a wall or anything like that it does sound pretty bad um so i'm gonna try and tune it in dial it in as we go along and my windows is absolutely playing up my camera may jump down now guys so bear with me There we go. Now, let's see if it jumps back down again. I bet it will. It did last time. No, it actually playing ball. Wow, I'm surprised. So, there we go. Let's, let's restart this one. Because we didn't get underway very well. Still will we'll lock up. So, this is our maiden voyage in Formula 1. I don't like this one. I like the Australian one. And I like the British as well. But, we have the steering wheel, we have the pedals. We don't have the wheel cam that we had yesterday. Every time we click to go back into the game, the webcam sort of pans over a little bit and down a bit so it doesn't look right. And then when I go back out, line it all back up, click back in the game, it does exactly the same. So it's something to do with Formula One. This didn't actually automatically pick up on the game um, capture as well in Streamlabs OBS. So we've had to do it a slightly different way. Hopefully Formula One 2021, when that comes out, will automatically pick up in Streamlabs OBS. I'm hoping. If not, we will find some way of bringing it through. But we'll, we will see. As you can tell, we are using the steering wheel. We're moving our head side to side. So let's get back down to the track. We qualified in 20th, right at the back of the grid. So let's head down to track side and get this race underway. And we are off. And we already have a damaged wing in the front as everything crashes down in front of us. This is one of the tracks I absolutely hated on every Formula One game. Because daft stuff like that, they break check you. Just get out the 
can't even get round the lap without a crack without a crack in at the front wing we've got a box straight away on lap one of five this steering wheel absolutely fighting me which I don't mind oh. we smashed the car to pieces typical Let's come out about there and slow down a bit. I think I was happy with NASCAR to be honest. I absolutely love Formula One. And we're gonna get a we're gonna get a flag for that. Absolutely sweating. I take it this is where we're supposed to box. That's tight. So what have you guys been up to today? Have you been up to much? Have you been anywhere nice? Let us know in the comments and share with us what you've been doing. Let while we come out of the pits. So let's try and get a better lap. Let's at least try and get round one lap without crashing. Get round that bend. And we are trying to make our way around one, at least one lap without crashing. And we hit that wing again. Not good. So DRS is now invited. Not not that we're anywhere in any place to use the DRS. We're in at nineteenth. So we have gone up a place. That's a bonus in itself while we get used to the steering wheel and the pedals at this level. I haven't played this game for uh, quite a while. So please forgive me if I'm a bit rusty. I should do full length. I can't even get around one lap without hitting the car up, Chris. Maybe when I've picked up a little bit more, we would do some full length stuff. This I haven't I haven't played this since doing Forza Motorsports and now starting the NASCAR as well. Thought we'd give it a try with it being a pain with the the game capture in Streamlabs OBS. It doesn't wet it doesn't hook it properly, so all we get is the searching for game on Streamlabs OBS. We have to set it up a different way, which is unusual. So I'm hoping they fix that with Formula 1 2021.
Marisa Bucata coming in with the 100 stars. How you doing, Marisa? Sorry I didn't see your light pop up there. Thank you so, so much for the 100 stars. I hope you are very well. Hope you and the family are all well as well. Matty Bailey coming in with the like and the share there, buddy. Thank you so, so much. Hope you are very well too. And we've lost it. Oh, Monaco, geez. one of, if not the hardest circuit for overtaking. Indeed. I'm fighting with this steering wheel. Something chronic. What? My car went into the wall, so you're penalising me for it. Don't you think hitting the wall was bad enough as it is? And that front wing has absolutely been decimated. Blue flag conditions create a gap and let the car behind through. Create a gap and let the car behind go through. Well, go rep. No, don't hit me. Go round. You absolute Dilbert. You goober. Well, I think it's safe to say you've won this one, mate. I'm a complete lap behind you. One minute for 14 and right. I'm doing okay and they are too. Thank you. Hope you are doing well too. We, I'm trying to get back into Formula 1 and I'm having a very, very stressful time in doing so. But that was pointless. I think this is safe to say this one. No. L2, go back, go back. And let's see if we can flash back there. No, it doesn't want to let us do it. I think how many how many flashbacks do we have? Let's see if we can that's the break. That's the break. No, it's gonna smack us every time. Whitney Davidson in the house, little bodyguard. How you doing? Hope you're doing very well. I think it's safe to say we've lost this one. So we're going to retire from the session. Chris and Preston Brewster in the house. How you doing, Preston? You got your nuggies. Woohoo! Can't stay, just popped in to say hi. Okay. Not a problem. Yeah, yeah, Red Bull. <laughs> Go away. Don't like Red Bull. I don't even drink it. Now, let's discuss Ant. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? It's got to be Lando Norris, hasn't it? No, I don't even know who he is. So I'm going to try and drop the wheel settings down a little bit because I'm fighting a little bit too much with that. So drop that down a little tiny bit and put that up a little bit. Leave that there. Let's see how that goes. Good at Mike's boss's daughter's graduation party. Ooh. Very nice. Right, let's give it another shot. I'm going to pick a track this time. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna stick with the Ferrari, the legendary Ferrari, the legendary Ferrari. We're gonna take over Sebastian Vettel. Mm, I want to find a good circuit. There, I love this. So we're going to do a qualifying. We're going to do one shot qualifying. I'd love to do a formation lap. 25% of a race. Whew. So let's get that started. This is one of my favourite tracks. The Circuit, the Spa, Franco Champ, craw Crawfish Boil, probably the last. Oh no! I'm missing out on Crawfish Boils. I can't wait to come over to the States and try crawfish boils. Especially the famous Davidson crawfish boil. So 
so we're on the one shot qualifying so let's go to the track see how we do you'll probably hear the steering wheel more but it is giving me some fight back this is how I like to have the steering wheel unfortunately it makes a little bit too much noise for you guys If it does, let me know in the comments. As we are flying across that top straight, coming down towards that long S bend, we fly around as we're heading down towards the downhill section of the circuit. Come around that tight bend there. You guys know us, we've done this circuit so many times before in Forza Motorsport 7. This is one of the legendary Formula 1 tracks, which, may I add, is the testing circuit for Red Bull. And there's the ghost, so that is a pole position we are chasing. So at the moment, we are currently neck and neck with the uh, pole position ghost of qualifying. So let's see how well we can do in this one shot qualifying. We're not doing too bad, I don't think. He absolutely bolted it. As we come to that tight chicane at the end of the circuit. We're going to get a good position this time, I believe. Where did we come on qualifying? We've qualified. Where did we come? We came second. Now that is better. That is much, much better. I am happy with second place in qualifying. So we start second on the grid for the Circuit de Spa Franco Champ Grand Prix. Five laps. And with qualifying complete. Let's review our top three today. Hamilton, Vettel and Valtteri Bottas. Goodbye for now then, but we're really just getting started. Make sure to join us again for Lights Out tomorrow. Yeah, Lights Out tomorrow, as in 30 seconds. That was a bit of a better qualifying, I think. I enjoyed that one. Then this is one of my favourite circuits in Formula 1 and racing. So, it's 21 degrees. It's light cloud. It's going to be dry. He almost sounds like always, a man with plenty of racing experience joins me in the commentary box. Today it's Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, you're no stranger to surviving the melee of turn one. So how do you keep out of trouble when there's so much going on around you? There are three main things to worry about there, Crofty. Positioning, awareness, and discipline. First, you have to put your car in a bit of space and make sure you have room to react to what the others are doing. Then you have to watch your mirrors and listen to the sounds around you to get a sense of where everyone is. And finally, just don't get too greedy. Just because a gap exists doesn't always mean you should go for it. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Let's not. Let's not, because we know where we are. We're second place. Okay, here we go. I know what you can do. Don't let me down. So, we start in, in second place. We know what we're doing. If we get around that first bend and shoot off leaving the rest of the pack behind us we know we're in for a good race if we get caught up in the tussle on that first hairpin bend we're going to be in trouble he almost sounded as good as me telling you about the track land 4.35 miles takes me back to my forza motorsports seven streams how i miss those so let's go down to track side we are going to go on a roller 
and we are off. Hamilton getting onto that line straight away. Let's try and get around the outside. And onto that straight. We get around there. No scrapes at all. As we go up that. Whoa. We nearly lose control there. We managed to regain it. We lose a position to Bottas. But hopefully we can pull it back within four laps. Going around this section of the track is going to be quite a trek because it's quite bendy and turning. But we're going to go into a downhill section shortly where they will slow down at some point. So we will get a chance to overtake as we take that corner wide. We fly it back in. Trying to stick to that line as best we can. Yeah, let's get round the first part of the race first before you start focusing on the rest, mate. Another one that likes his radio. We found somebody else that likes to talk over the radio and give direct orders. So Verstappen takes third place, knocking us down into fourth. All is not lost, though. We have the straights. As we come around that bend, he drives into us. That should have been a flag. And we are in fourth place as we come to the end of lap one. We have four other laps remaining. Let's get around this tight S bend as best we can. Nice and tidy. Lewis Hamilton picks up the fastest lap for lap one. Let's go on the inside. We damage our wing, but we pull back a position. So we're back in third place. I know I took some minor damage. I did see. And we pull it back into third place as we head up the uphill section onto the top straight. We're chasing second place at Bottas. He is literally just about a second ahead and we're slowly gaining on him. He will slow down shortly as he comes to that long open S-bend. A little bit of oversteer there so we've knocked down again. Still we are not reacting as fast as I want it to. We're losing a few positions. We dropped down into 7th. That's not good. That's not good at all. And we drop down another place into 8th. So we want to be chasing a little bit more. How have I got a collision? And we've absolutely smashed that front wing. I didn't get a collision. They collided with me. Race officials obviously blind. And we've got hardly any control. We're fighting. No. No, I'm not. I'm getting cheated out of positions. So, let's go back a little bit to where we took the bump. Let's see if we can get back there. Let's see if we can get back on the track without being hit. We nearly got hit there. The steering wheel really, really not doing us any justice at all. So we've dropped right the way down to the back of the pack. We were in second. We were doing so well. The steering wheel is not fighting as much as I want it to. It's fighting, but it's not giving us the turn. If that's something to do with this, the sensitivity, I don't know. We. Right? This is going to be a repeat again. Let's see if we can go in. No, I don't want to do any of that stuff. Go back, go back. Trista Ramsey in the house. How are you doing? Hope you are very, very well. Thank you for the like. The three roosters in the house. You okay? Hmm? Ah. Yeah, we're having a struggle with the steering wheel on this one. And I don't know why. Uh, 
let's try for my flashback. Preston Brewster in the house. How you doing, buddy? Hope you are very, very well. Right, let's see if we can get a flashback from there. See if we can get back on. I'm just chilling while watching you. Ah, oh, bless you. Preston, how are the chicken nuggets? Chicken nuggets. Ash Parker coming in. How you doing, buddy? Thank you for the like on the stream. Having a few issues with the steering wheel on this one. I'm not really happy with it. It's not giving me the turn that I want. We did so well in qualifying. We came second. And now all of a sudden, it's just not doing what I want it to do. Maybe it's something to do with one of the settings. You just ate all the nugs. Oh, boy. One of these days, on one of your birthdays, we're going to get you a chicken nuggies mountain. So you can have a chicken nuggie feast on your birthday. And that's our wheel gone. Every time, it's just doing my head in. Let's see if we can change the sensitivity on the wheel a little bit more. Because it's not doing what I want it to do. Uh, let's go 270. And turn that sensitivity up a bit more to 75. Is that going to oh, be? Oh, yeah. There we go. So, that is that done. Hopefully, we can get a bit more underway. Let's do a flashback there. I think we might have to adjust it in the preferences. Force feedback. No, we don't want generic. We want the... G29, edit the force feedback. Uh, da, 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 da. Um. Let's turn that up a bit more. Let's go up to 75. Save it to G29 mouse. And go back and back. Now that feels a little bit better. Let's see if we can make it any better on the track. Nope, it's still not giving me the feedback that I want. Yeah, the marshals can come all they like. I'm still having a tough one with this. I just don't understand why it's not doing what I want it to do. No, 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 no. Okay, the time last lap was a 223.3. You just ate some pizza. Absolutely awesome. What flavour pizza did you have, Ellis? Did you have something nice? Ham and pineapple? Cheese and tomato or pepperoni? Or let us know in the chat, Ellis. What flavour pizza did you have? I'm absolutely struggling with this wheel tonight. NASCAR, absolutely fine. I think it's because I'm out of practice with the steering wheel on this game. Ham and pineapple, what a pizza. I'm not a fan of pineapple on pizza myself, but I won't knock it because I don't really like it. But if you enjoy it, you enjoy it. Kiwi pizza. Is that another one of those odd ones, Preston? I hear that I hear that they do seafood pizzas. Now I'm I, I love seafood, but on a pizza? Hmm. Seafood pizza is the of. I had one many many years ago. There was tuna, there was mussels, there was cockles, the prawns, cheese, tomato. Yeah, it was lovely. The only thing about a seafood pizza is you've really got to like seafood. Come on, get around that Ben. Me 
me I love a good meat feast all the meats I love my meat feast well we're definitely doing a bit better than what we did the last couple of laps it's a shame that we're doing a little bit of a fight with this uh, steering wheel and we've had so many issues with this game so I'm hoping that they fix those issues when 2021 comes out you don't like spicy food it's each to their own Alice some people like spicy food some don't I'd, I'd like spicy food but it doesn't agree with me I absolutely love spicy food but my stomach after eating spicy food goes I'm gonna make you pay now you fancy pizza now so do I a lovely meat feast with a barbecue base making me hungry now and I'm supposed to be racing we've got another hour Spice food gives me gas. Um, yeah. You're ma <laughs> Ellis, don't worry. You're making me hungry, which means I'm going to enjoy my food when I do eat. I'm ordering a Chinese rock. Okay. Stream's over. Let's all head to Ashes. We're, we're going to have a Chinese at Ashes. Ash, you can't say that. Yeah, Preston, when we have spicy food, you really... Yep. Let, let's all head over to Ash's Chinese Saturday night. Mm -hmm. That'll do. Pot round, you're, you're only up the road. Yeah, I know. You'll have to send me your uh, address in my inbox. I'll be there in about half an hour to an hour. <laughs> but Preston, you should hear Chrissy when she's had spicy food. I have to. I have to sit in here for a little bit when she goes through. <laughs> Greg Davis coming in with the like on the stream. How are you doing, Greg? Hope you're very, very well. Rob, you and Christy should come to Scotland sometime. It would be nice. To me We've been to Scotland before. Uh, we did. Uh, we did Birmingham to Scotland and back down to Birmingham in a day. Kean Duffy in the house. How are you doing, Kean? Hope you're very, very well. Thank you for coming in, but guys. If you haven't already, please tickle that like button. It helps the stream so much and it doesn't cost you a penny. We're trying out Formula One 2020 and we're not having a good night. I'm not having a brilliant race night tonight. Thank you for the light there, Kian. Really do appreciate that, buddy. Mine is the silent stinky. Yeah, no, Chrissy. Chrissy's are both. They're, they're per and for. Even Rhonda, our little baby cat jumps in the window and goes I'm not coming out from here so this is lap 5 of 5 we aren't doing the best I think I should have stuck with the NASCAR races we were doing so well silent but deadly indeed well Chrissy doesn't do silent but deadly she does loud and deadly don't hit that wall as long as we don't hit that wall we'll be fine It's me when I've had spicy food. I don't trust. I don't trust the, the gas. Because I love my spicy food, but my spicy food. Spicy food doesn't agree with my stomach. Okay, Ash, that was a fast Chinese.
So we finished that one. We finish in last place. Are you on tomorrow? Of course we are, Ellis. I will be streaming twice tomorrow. Once in the morning, once in the evening. Chrissy will be streaming between the two with Dead by Daylight on the Miss Chrissy 85 gaming page. Guys, if you haven't already, please head over. Oh, shut up. Head. Shut up. Shut up. Head over to the Miss Chrissy 85 gaming page. Drop her a like, drop her a follow. Watch her when she streams Dead by Daylight. That game makes her jump. Now she's on a PC. She used to stream on her phone. How about, how about we don't? Shut up. I'm trying to talk to the people. The people that matter. So, Chrissy used to stream on her phone. And we've made her a Windows 10 profile on my PC. Preston, you are awesome. 88 days followers. I'm sure it's wrong, but it's not far off. Now we've made Chrissy a Windows 10 profile on my PC. She has a haul, all has all all of her games on the PC, so she can stream through Streamlabs on her own profile to you, the people. Head over there. Chrissy will be streaming approximately 1 p.m. tomorrow, if not earlier. And check her out when she plays Dead by Daylight. You should hear her scream and jump. It's funny. I sat and watched her today and it was absolutely hilarious while I was at work. I saw some of you guys in there, so thank you for sharing. And well, thank you for being supportive as you are. You guys are absolutely amazing. Supporting us, the Mouse Gaming Team, and Miss Chrissy when she streams on her page. Headphones make it worse. They do indeed. Let's knock that off there. Let's see who came in. Jerry, me, Endersby. That is Mr. Clubman Mad Gaming himself. How are you doing, buddy? Hope you are very well. Thank you for coming in. We are trying a little dab of Formula One. How are you doing, buddy? Hope you are very, very well. There you go. There's the double C. I even remembered. I, I got the logo, but my, my, my logo didn't want to update on my page for some reason which is strange it should have done it didn't update on the on the stream deck so i'm gonna double check that one because i'm sure i had your new logo let me have a look i'm sure i did oh it's not in there it's in downloads mouse gaming yeah i, I thought i did there we go. I know I had I had your logo on the stream deck. I, I downloaded it specifically. So guys, please head over to the Clubman Club Clubman Mad Gaming page. Preston, I I'm thinking about it, but as you can tell, I have so many issues. Now Matt Clubman, I want your name to be seen there. And I'm going to fix the camera while I can. There we go. Rob can set them up for me when I get them back. Yes, indeed. We are still trialling with Chrissy running on the PC now, seeing if it will kick in and give her her stars back. Apparently, there is a glitch on Facebook which is causing Chrissy not to be able to have stars. It says she hasn't streamed for four hours and two days out of 14 days but she has because she's been here with you guys every day doing uh, world of warcraft and dead by daylight on the weekends and she's streamed over the time it's just facebook say that she hasn't which is an absolute pain anyway guys please head over to club man mad gaming drop him a like drop him a follow miss jenny gunther in the house how you doing jenny Hope you're very, very well. DB, 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 DB. Dead by Daylight. I know, I know what DB, 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 DB is. I'd love to get back into that game myself. But when we get your graphics card upgraded on your PC, then we will have some matches indeed. Yeah, I'll be shouting over to you. Unhook me, unhook me. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> so... I won't be able to stream it because I am a PG streamer. Chrissy streams at 80. You want to play it with someone? Well, maybe one day, Jenny. 
when Chrissy gets her graphics card, which is not too far away, me, Chrissy, yourself, possibly some other people can jump in and we can all have a laugh. But tune in tomorrow, Jenny. Chrissy is streaming Dead by Daylight. If you are there when she starts streaming, it may be early, I'm not too sure. 18 plus. I can't do it. I, I need to be PG to get out there. And unfortunately, I, I like being PG. Um, my content will get pushed a little bit more. And when I feel it's time to move up, I will move up. But at the moment, I'm happy being PG. Chrissy streams at 18 plus though. So, you can join her when she streams Dead by Daylight. It, it may be a little bit earlier, early in the morning for you guys in the States. But, Chrissy has a good time playing, World of, uh, playing Dead by Daylight and also World of Warcraft. So, tune in. Jenny, you could possibly be highlighted on Miss Chrissy 85 gaming page alongside other people. I might, but I know I, I, I can't go on Dead by Daylight with you when you're streaming on my PC. Which is a shame. Because I'll probably be the one on the hook most of the time. <laughs> So there you go. Let's have a look for another race to do. Um, we'll go into the Formula One 2020. We'll change the Ferrari this time. We'll go with Red Bull. I don't even know who he is. Uh, let's have a look for a track to do. Is that my favourite one? I want my favourite one. I, yeah, Brazil. Casual. I like playing with people who are awful and then I can... Yep, yeah, I'm absolutely terrible, so you'd have a, an absolute laugh against me. Now, Jenny, the question is, do you like playing as a survivor or the killer? As we head to the Brazilian Grand Prix, we're doing the one-shot qualifying. Let's see where we're going to qualify. Always Survivor. I need to learn it a bit more. Chrissy's learned much, much more than me. But we've I've been streaming mainly racing games, which I love my racing games. But I do play World of Warcraft as well when I get time. I love my World of Warcraft. That takes me back 16 years. So, we head over that start line. Let's see if we can have a better race now. We're having a little bit of a better race with this one. Maybe it was just a car, I don't know. We seem to be doing a lot better on this race than what we did on my favourite track. Of all tracks not to do your best is your favourite track. But we have a tiny lead over the ghost car as we come to the uphill bend which is going to take us onto the home straight. Go over that line which enables the DRS as we come onto the home straight and we go over that line to finish qualifying. Let's see where we came. Okay, so it must have been the race. So we are gaining a few things. To remind ourselves of our top three Verstappen, Hamilton, and Valtteri Bottas. And well, we wraps up qualifying, but don't worry. Oh, we shut up. We qualify as Verstappen, and we are qualifying in first.
I think tomorrow night for me it's going to be back in NASCAR. Not enjoying it. No, nah, I'm not enjoying this at all. Offline maybe when I get back into it maybe, but I'm enjoying the NASCAR a lot more. So as we wait for the green lights so we can go. And we are off. We get a good start off the grid as we hit that first turn. Thanks, Jenny. Thanks for the vote of confidence. One way to beat a streamer up. Give it a shot on a controller. I can't hear you, Chris. I've got the headset on. <laughs> Give it a shot on the controller. Maybe I've heard some go. I oh, what I've. I, it's one of those games um, you need every game has its own sort of preset sort of thing and it's weird NASCAR is okay at some settings Formula 1 has its own sort of unique twist and it has to be right if you don't get it right then it, it doesn't work I try my best, Steve. Stephen. I try my best. I'm not having much luck tonight. Maybe with a controller, it could be different. But I'm trying to get used to the steering wheel because I've used the controller all the way through Forza Motorsport 7. And I played it offline with a controller. And at the moment, this is the first time I've actually picked this game up. I've played this game in over a good three to four months no, about three months so it's i suppose it's just getting used to it again at, at the moment i feel like I'm, I'm a machine at racing uh that the machine needs servicing I've seen, I think I've seen Jenny play Dead by Daylight. I want to learn some tips from her as a survivor. Chrissy is good as a survivor too. I want to learn from everybody that plays Dead by Daylight. I, I want to learn from Rage. I want to learn from Nixil. I want to learn from Jenny. I want to learn from Chrissy. I want to learn from Kenny. I want to learn from absolutely everybody. Because I'm, I'm no good at it. You had too many nugs. Oh dear. Everybody form a perimeter. Preston may be about to release the Preston nuke. I've seen so many people play Dead by Daylight and so many people are awesome at it. I'm absolutely rubbish. So I'll be the first one to probably die. Definitely getting a workout tonight with this. But we're not doing too bad. We're actually holding a position. We haven't had a smash on this course. He says as he nearly kisses the wall. We enable the DRS. We're chasing Hamilton. Good job. That was the fastest lap of the race so far. Eh. Ooh. We're finally doing something good. DRS is enabled. We are literally a second behind Hamilton. No, we're half a second behind Hamilton. Steering real, really fighting back. I'm just gutted that this game isn't Streamlabs OBS compatible. We've had to do a different method of bringing 
the game through Streamlabs, not the standard loaded up and off you go job. But we managed to bring it to the stream nonetheless. I hope they fix up that thing in Formula 1 2021. I will be absolutely practicing the pants off that game. As the steering wheel starts fighting back, we come onto the home straight. We enable the DRS, fighting against the steering wheel. This is your final lap, final lap of the race. A final lap of the race, and we are still sat constantly in third. Can we get second? Can we push for second? Don't want to do too much damage. No. That kiss on the wall took us out a little bit. Slowed us down a bit too much and Hamilton slipped back into second. But we're not going to give up without a fight. And we are fighting to stay on the track. Trying to hug that line. But that's a NASCAR saying so we'll have to say ride to the line. I probably could do better with the controller. But I want to try and do as many racing games with the steering wheel as possible. Johnny Woods in the house. How you doing, buddy? Hope you are very, very well. Johnny from... Average Wolf 69. Head over there, guys. Drop a like and drop a follow if you like the content. Good evening, bro. How's you? Just dropping by to in to say hi. I've been working flat out the last four days and still tomorrow to go. Hope you all well. We're very well, thank you, buddy. We're giving Formula One a little try. We picked up a third, so at least we ended up on the podium. There's us in third, finally. Thank you for the like and the share there, Stephen. Really do appreciate that, buddy. So we pick up we pick up a trophy a small one indeed but it's a trophy nonetheless and we get a bottle of champagne as well now i wouldn't be wasting it like that i'd be drinking it i wouldn't be leaving the podium sober so we pick up a third place that that is good for us at least some amazing talents out on the track today but anthony would you pick as your driver of the day? Well, Ants, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. He, he asked the question and nobody answered. That's clever. I wonder why I hate chefing and being back. I realise why the heat is killing me. And it's been warm today as well, Johnny, as well, so that didn't help matters. But hope you're keeping well, buddy. And uh, just remember, stay safe. When you're working in the heat, remember to drink plenty of water. I used to be a chef and I used to have constant bottles of water. So, okay, we've done that. So, now we have it set. Let's see if we can go into my career. This is the career round two. This is our car. Next race is the 19th of March, which is three days. So we're going to advance the time on that. Is this race day or is it right? It's the race weekend. So let's go to the race weekend. Yeah, it's like today, Johnny. I was at work. I got, um, I was in for eight this morning. Yeah, we're just going to go straight for qualifying. So while that loads up, I'm going to take a sip of my coffee. I 
hold it the right way around would be good. My awesome mug from Customized Inks. Jay Hartfield absolutely smashing these out of the park. They are absolutely awesome. I know the writing is backwards, but look at the glossy finish on that, making it look absolutely amazing. So, lock the top on there so I don't, if I knock it over, it's not gonna go flying everywhere. So we're gonna simulate up to, where are we? Workstation. Let's start the qualifying. This is one shot qualifying. And they're going to give us the rundown on the track, give us the elevation, and give us the track details. And it's a nighttime track, too. So everybody rushing around trying to get all the information they need. Let's go to the track. The track is 29 degrees. The air temperature is 23 degrees Celsius. So quite a warm night in Bahrain. So let's go to the track. Let's see where we come. Let's see where we come on this one shot qualifying. We lock the DRS on and there we go let's go around that first bend under the lights the lights are really bright tonight let's lock that DRS in and around that bend we go we are slightly in front of the pole position ghost so if as long as we can stay behind in well, stay in front of the ghost we will qualify in pole lock on DRS again Mr. Jetstream in the house, Mr. Jet coming in with the uh, double likes. So how are you doing, buddy? Hope your voice is a little bit better. Let's get that dub, of course. Jess coming in with a star train. Guys, please get some hashtag Jesses in the comments. Come on, let's get this qualifying. Where did we qualify? Oh! Okay, good job, mate. Really well done. That was a fantastic drive. The car went all over the place as we went over the line. <laughs> Crazy. Jess, thank you. I'm going to throw up... Where's my things gone? Everything's moved around tonight. We're all ready for tomorrow's race, but before we begin... Jess absolutely railing that alert box. Thank you so, so much. I'm going to set that to go ahead. We qualified in first place. Hopefully we can stick there. Ah, uh, this is what... This is where you have to multi-select questions.
Jess, you're an absolute legend. You've absolutely smashed that alert box. I think the alert box is having a problem trying to keep up. There we go, I think it's caught up. Jess, you're amazing. I'm going to throw it up one more time, just for you. I've got to do some new ones with the mouse, mouse gaming gear on. There we go. Thank you so, so much. And just as an extra thank you, I'm going to throw a hashtag Jess up in the comments as well. There we go. So we qualified in first place. Let's see if we've got 14 laps. This is going to be a challenge indeed. Let's see what the messages are. Apparently, we have messages. Never mind. Ah, L2. R2. Yeah, nothing important. Go back on there and let's go to the race let's get this 14 lap race underway let's see if we can get that pole position and the podium in pole so it's time to see how our drivers are stepping up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session it's McLaren in pole position there and Max Verstappen lines up alongside. As we continue through the rest of the grid today, we have Bottas. No, we're not going to continue. We know we're in first place. That's what that's what matters. Points on the board. Let's continue this form and aim for another top ten finish. Let's aim for a first place finish, not a top ten. And we are waiting for those lights to go out. And we are off. What a great start that was we have a little bit of a lead as we come into that first very tight bend let's see if we can get around and avoid the clutter around that bend we do let's put our foot down and see if we can make some more headway on the rest of the pack now we're in first of 20 lap 1 of 14 taking these corners trying to stick to that line as best we can The steering wheel giving us a little bit of kickback. Just how it should be. I like a little bit of kickback on the wheel. Okay, that's a good start. Keep it up. And straight off, get back on that track. We've lost some positions already. How do we have a collision? We didn't even touch him. He went past. Now we dropped down into seventh. So now we're playing a catch-up game. We've got 14 laps to try and catch up. And we get the green flag so we can continue the race. As we come down the home straight to finish lap one into lap two. Here we come to that tight bend again. At the end of that home straight. We've gone down to seventh, that little bit of an overturn and coming off the circuit. But we are in the slipstream of Perez in sixth. We've got to find a little place where we can either overtake him or undertake him. Not go into the back of him. Uh, 
and not I don't want to be going into the back of drivers that's where we start getting penalty points and stuff not the best As we fly back round onto the home straight, we're still in seventh. We're approaching the pit window. We'll the pit window. They're making us pit. Okay, let's see if we can get in here. We managed to get that undertake just on that bend. He's trying to gonna, gonna try and get that position back. We're not gonna let him. Let's put the DRS on. See if we can get ahead a little bit. We want to get up a few more positions before they take the pit. We're on lap 3 of 14. We've lost a few positions with that crash. Well, a spin out. It wasn't really a crash. And we have managed to gain one position back since. A little bit of oversteer there taking that corner a bit too wide as we come around that very tight bend the steering wheel fighting against me again but we are still managing to keep up with the front of the pack as we come around that bend onto the home straight is it a home straight? no still going I thought it was the home straight now we're on the home straight so when do we have to pit they're gonna give us a pit at some point okay so we're pitting at the end of this lap Put that DRS on and try and keep up with the front five cars in the pack. Let's see if we can sneak another one in there. So we managed to sneak up another position. But we're going to box at the end of this so we may lose a position or two. Depending on where they're going to box as well. get a little bit of a tap there luckily we didn't get a penalty for that one DRS on where are we we're in P5 on lap 4 of 14 so we are doing pretty well I think but we're gonna lose a few positions when we box in for the change of the tires Yes, I know, that's why we're boxing in. As we come, we're going to try and pit in. Normally it will take us out. There we go. So there we hit the pit lane. We're going to pit in now. And they're going to change our tyres for the medium. There we are. We are now on the medium tire. We're losing positions. Someone retired from the race. Bear in mind, the rest of the cars now have to pit. So they will pit. So we will get a few positions back. We've dropped down to 19th. I said we would lose positions. I didn't think it would be that many. But now it's a case of waiting for them to pit and we can take our strategy. We've done our strategy and pitted early. Which means these tyres will last us for the next nine laps. Which means we won't have to stop. Cars are dropping. There's cars that aren't finishing. But cars will now be looking to pit. 
which means we have an opportunity oh somebody came off pretty hard there we now have the opportunity when they pit to gain some more positions because some cars will they will pit now between now and the next couple of laps which means we will go up a few positions we're on lap 5 of 14 and we're not doing too bad because this is the long stretch and then we have the home stretch so hopefully a couple of cars will pit in we will go up from 18th we are still last because two cars have have retired from the race nobody's pitted in yet I don't think looking at the map nobody's pitted in yet so the next couple of laps or so they will start pitting in to change their tires for their strategy every strategy for each team is different we pitted early to get the medium tires to last us for the entire race these tires are going to last us for 10 laps which we will take us to the end of the race they may be a little worn out at the end but they are going to last us till the end of the race indeed So we are high on the tail of 17th position, Latifi. And we can see a group of the cars up front. We're going to start looking to overtake him at some point. When the going is good, I think now is the time to make that move. We slip just in front of Latifi. A slight overtake there but a risk worth taking for just to get that position our teammate is in the pit so now we're gonna start making up positions if we can get round faster there's a few cars that have pitted in watch our position go up in the top left hand corner of your screen we are now in 10th so they are deciding to start pit, pitting now, halfway through the race. We pitted a little bit early. So we pitted on lap four. So the tyres are going to last us for 10, they've got to last us for 10 laps. Hopefully we don't make any drastic mistakes which are going to cost us any more positions. So the next car in front is 2.8 seconds ahead, which is absolutely nothing because when they slow down to go around the tight bends, we catch up. And then we have to slow down too, but we are doing our best to keep up with them. As you can see, they are literally just in front of us. That gap coming down ever so slightly every turn. We're going to look for the opportune moment to do the overtake. Ben Wright coming in with the like on the stream. How are you doing, buddy? Hope you're doing very, very well. Thank you for coming in and dropping the like there. How are you doing, buddy? We are halfway through. This Grand Prix everybody is starting to pit now there's some more of the front runners pitting in that takes us up to p5 no we're in p3 there were two cars already in the pit in front so we are now in third so we're chasing two leaders so let's see if we can catch up with them are they going to try and do a, a late strategy and pit late we have six six laps remaining in this race. Are they going to pit late? Thinking that everybody else is going to pit in and they're going to take advantage of that. Or maybe they've already pitted. I'm not too sure. But we're chasing them either way. So let's get up to them. They're not that far ahead. 2.5 seconds. And we've seen how fast 2.5 seconds is. 
as we come around that bend we're literally chasing them down we're catching up with Hamilton two seconds just under two seconds he is losing speed over that or we're just we're just doing awesome and catching up He's definitely losing speed. Now, are they going to pit in? Or are they going to keep going? Nope, they're not pitting in yet. Jonathan Carter coming in with 50 stars. Thank you so much, Jonathan. Guys, please get some hashtag paintbrushes in the chat. Spam that heart button. As an appreciation to Mr. Paintbrush himself, Mr. Jonathan Carter. As we are chasing Lewis Hamilton in second place. We are literally on Lewis Hamilton's tail, less than a second behind him. I've got a feeling we're going to find somewhere on this circuit and overtake him. Or is he going to play sly? Let's get on the ins. No, I was going to say, let's get on the inside. We can't get on the inside there. Get out of the way. Let's lock that DRS in. Get past him there. On the straight. That's better. Tyler Hall in the house. Big T, how you doing, buddy? Hope you are very, very well. Thank you for coming in with the light there. We are fighting with Lewis Hamilton. And we won that fight, I think. He's literally on our tail. He's a little bit goosed that we uh, took his position. But now we've peeled in a gap between us and him. He's half a second behind us. And we're not going to give up there. We're chasing. We're now chasing Bottas. We have five laps remaining. Now we're into four. Four laps remaining. So is four laps going to be enough to catch up with Bottas and take that pole position? I hope so. And as I line up on the straight, Big D, welcome in, buddy. Look, Mom, one-handed. As we come around that bend... We are literally on Bottas's tail. Uh, literally a second behind him. Hamilton is literally 2.2 seconds behind us. Get around that bend. No mistakes this time. Just getting up from a nap and about to clean the house. Oh, the, everybody's having a spring clean day today. And to everybody celebrating Memorial Weekend, happy, well, it's not happy Memorial, have a great weekend. It's not, a, it's not really a celebration, but have a, an amazing Memorial Weekend. Let's lock that DRS in. We are still just a fraction under a second. Our teammate is really, really slow. 18 seconds behind us. What did he do? Stop for uh, some chicken nuggets and a, and a milkshake. So, we managed to slide into pole position. We have three laps to go two more laps after this one can we keep that pole position we've been driving so well so far can we keep it going I am absolutely baking under these lights it is really really warm it's gone really really warm tonight
So as we make our way around the, the, the last part of this track onto the home straight, we are still in first by half a second. Bottas is literally on our tail. Preston, you down you downed 14 notes. Holy moly. Somebody definitely enjoys their chicken nuggies. There's three laps of fuel remaining. Three laps of fuel two laps remaining so we're gonna have a lap for a lap a lap's worth of fuel left in the car just if we play it safe if we don't play it safe then we could possibly run out before we finish the race and I've had that happen before in a previous Formula One game way before I was streaming I ran out of fuel So as we make our way down the back side of the circuit, come around that bend to the right. We got over that start line, stop lap 13 of 14. We're still in pole position and that gap is growing between us and Bottas and Hamilton. Jonathan coming in with the 100 stars. Thank you so much, Jonathan. Really do appreciate that, buddy. Guys, please get some hashtag paintbrush in the chat and spam that hot button. Jeff, the legend, the Australian legend in the house with the double, eager gaming. Jeff, you, we have hyped you most of today. I've hyped you while I'm at work. How are you doing, buddy? Did you rest well? Are you excited? How are you doing, my man? Hope you're very, very well. Jeff, don't be nervous, buddy. Everybody that comes to watch you is going to be supporting you. Everybody is going to be behind you. We will be there cheering you on, buddy. We can't wait to see what you're going to bring for us. You will be absolutely amazing. So as we make our way round, there's only one lap of fuel remaining. One lap of fuel, and we're on that lap. <laughs> <laughs> there's the ordinance. Preston is wiring up. That ordinance ready to be delivered. Jeff, you're going to do absolutely awesome, buddy. We believe in you. We're going to be there cheering you on, supporting you. Everybody's going to be there. You're going to do absolutely amazing, my friend. Above all, just be yourself, buddy. 
as we come down the home straight we finally have one for tonight I have to say we've had a, a pretty okay stream we go into the career mode and career mode brings it out in us Jeff bringing in the good luck So that is a win for us finally. Our winning drivers are on their way to the podium right now. It's been a fantastic race for McLaren, that's for sure. And no doubt they'll be celebrating tonight. And I think he I think he looks like me and off we go. We are celebrating in style with the champagne, chicken half of it away. I would love to be drinking that champagne, not wasting it. But we picked up a pole position finally. So we pick up our XP. And we hit current tier number two. Come to tier number three. Number four. We're picking up loads of XP. So we hit current tier number four in our career mode. The Let's see how the driver standings have changed. And after a thrilling race, we see a new name heading up the championship standings. After an incredible day of racing, who was your driver of the day, Ant? I have to say Sebastian Vettel certainly caught my eye during today's race. Incredible driving. Lance Stroll certainly put in an impressive performance today. No doubt his team and fans are extremely proud. I know that's at odds with the official decision, but I think they deserve some recognition on a day where both of these drivers are at the top of their game. It's time to check out the constructors' standings. Mercedes continue to extend their lead. Another team that excelled today was Williams make further progress up the table. Well, Ant, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. So, that is our career mode. That is, I think, here we go. comment if you make certain comments certain members of your team don't like you so we're not going to make decisions on that we want to stay in good with all the team and there we go we go to driver acclaim level four so i think we're going to stick if we do stick with this game we're going to stick with the career mode because it seems a lot more friendly with us our next Grand Prix will be in Vietnam. So that one, we may come back to this. I, I'm, I was enjoying the. There's our email. Here's what we think of our performance currently sits in in the pecking order. The other teams are consistently bringing upgrades to the table. So up in a few races time, this list could look very different. We need to make sure we keep on top of our own R and D as well. Uh, so pretty much everything. Be right back. I've got some hyping I need to do. Of course, Preston. What we're going to do, we've done that so we can go back. Our next race in the Formula 1 season, if we decide to carry this on, will be in Vietnam. I won't be touching this away from the stream unless I'm practicing getting used to the wheel 
So, but I think the career mode is the way forward with this one. But I, I'm sort of drawn back to NASCAR. I'm actually enjoying NASCAR. I'm just not enjoying the career mode at the moment with it being on the extreme dirt championships. So what we're going to do for now is we're going to wrap it up there. Jeff will be streaming in approximately 1 hour 20 minutes if I'm not mistaken. Jeff, please correct me if I am wrong. Just wait for Jeff to comment in the chat there. Good morning Vietnam indeed Tyler. That will be our next race if we decide to keep Formula One going. But I'm actually enjoying NASCAR at the moment and switching between two games is a little bit difficult with the setups. My PC the PC doesn't actually the Streamlabs OBS doesn't like this version of Formula One. Yet this is a retail game through Steam. Doesn't make sense. But I'm not sure if Jeff can hear me, but I think he is streaming in about an hour and twenty, an hour and twenty's time. So hopefully you guys can head over and see Jeff over at Eager Gaming. Head over there, drop your like, drop your follow. Make sure you tune in when Jeff goes live in just. Is it an hour and twenty where you are pro where approximately where you're going live, buddy? Because it's nine forty p.m. here in the UK. I'm not sure what time. You, I know you put on your page that you're going live at five CST, I believe. I'm not sure how long away that is. Is it about an hour and twenty minutes from from now at the moment? about an hour okay so guys please head over to eager gaming drop a like drop a follow join us as we cheer jeff on in his debut stream let's get the uh support for jeff a long-standing moderator and making his debut as a streamer we can't wait we're all going to be there cheering him on Showing him the support that he's shown absolutely everybody else in the streaming world. So now, now Jeff is going to make his stand as a streamer. Daniel Lee and Lee, welcome in buddy. Hope you're doing very, very well. We're just about to head off. Please head over to Eager Gaming. Drop a like and drop a follow. Jeff will be streaming in approximately an hour. So we're all going to be over there cheering Jeff on when he streams tonight in approximately an hour's time so for now guys we're going to go and find somebody to raid so let's have a look see who is available please stay for the raid let's have a look the pure gamers are still live yeah let's go and let's go and blow up the pure gamers Jordi Gaz is streaming. I don't know if Gemma is still there, but it is Gemma's birthday. So let's go over with the hashtag mouse raid. Let's go and blow them up and show them some love. So if Chrissy can pop the link in the chat for the pure gamers. There we go, guys. If the raid doesn't take you over, that is the link that you need. I'll give you a couple of seconds to grab that link and we'll go over there and see if they are still celebrating Gemma's birthday let's go over with the hashtag mouse raid so for now guys Jeff will be streaming in about an hour join us over there at eager gaming and thank you for joining tonight we will catch you tomorrow morning where I will be possibly doing the grand utopia again so for now guys have a great evening Jeff, we will see you soon, buddy. Much love. Have a great evening, guys.